In this video, I'll be helping you with the Alex problem type called finding the average rate of change of a function. We're given the function g of x and asked to find the average rate of change between x equals negative 4 and x equals 1. And to do so, I'm going to use a formula that is very similar to the slope formula where you have the y value at the second point. So we'll call that g of x2, which is the height at the second point, minus the height or the y value at the first point over the distance between the second point and the first point. So going left to right, I will call this negative 4 my x1 and the 1 value my x2. So to substitute in, I will first find g of x2 x2 being 1, so g of 1 equals replacing x with 1, that's negative 1 squared plus 3 times 1 plus 4. Doing exponents first, that's negative 1. Notice that the negative is not being squared. 3 times 1 is 3 plus 4, so g of 1 is 6, so substituting in, this is 6 minus, now I have to find the g of x sub 1, which is our minus 4. So g of minus 4 is again replacing x's with minus 4's. A negative minus 4 squared plus 3 times minus 4 plus 4. Exponents first, the negative 4 being squared is 16, but the other negative is still outside. And then the 3 times minus 4 is a negative 12, bringing down the plus 4. Simplifying here gives us a negative 24. So replacing g of 1 with our new y value here of negative 24. And then in the denominator, we've already said that our x2 is 1 and that our x1 is a negative 4. So it's minus a negative 4. We can simplify this numerator to 6 plus a 24 and the denominator to 1 plus 4. So 30 in the numerator and 5 in the denominator, our average rate of change between these two points is 6.